The question of the exact shape and nature of the universe has occupied mankind for countless centuries. While people in the past believed that the Earth is the center of the universe around which all other celestial bodies rotate, we now know that our blue home planet is by no means the center of the universe. Rather, we're aware of the fact that our entire solar system is only a tiny part of a gigantic overall complex, the exact characteristics of which have yet to be determined. Researchers of our modern times have yet to clarify the question of the form of the universe beyond a reasonable doubt. In order to approach this topic, experts have developed some theoretical models, on the basis of which we base our current understanding of the structure and the form of our galactic homeland. However, the ranks of experts are hardly unified concerning this question. Over the years, the most diverse universe theories have been developed, and here, the Taurus model quite particularly stands out. Why some scientists believe that our galactic home might possess the form of a donut, and which theses are represented beyond that, we'll show you now in the following video. Do you get excited about the breathtaking spectacles, groundbreaking discoveries, and great puzzles of the universe? Then remember to subscribe to Simply Space, and never miss one of our videos in the future. Feel free to show us you like the content of our posts with a thumbs up. Now let's get started. The Shape of the Universe it's well known that due to the gigantic dimensions of the universe, as well as the spatial position of our Earth in space, it's not possible for us to grasp the exact dimensions and shape of the universe at a glance. That which we can see from our earthly point of view is defined as the observable universe. Due to natural circumstances, this term ultimately describes a spherical observation space that reflects our limited view of the universe. Every celestial body in the universe has its own observable universe as well, so this model can be applied to any entity in the galaxy. To draw conclusions from our limited terrestrial observations that extend to the total nature of the universe, scientists use the so-called cosmological principle. This basic scientific assumption is that the universe is homogeneous and isotropic. In simple terms, this means nothing more than that the universe always appears the same to the observer independent of his point of view and direction of observation. If one transfers the cosmological principle now to the field of cosmological research, it becomes possible for experts to fathom the characteristics of the entire universe with the help of the information collected with the investigation of the observable universe. The most important topics discussed in the course of this work deal with the question of the boundedness or infinity of the universe the characteristics of the spatial curvature, and the connectivity of the universe. The latter deals with the exact composition of our galactic home and delves into the question whether the universe is a simply connected space or a complex of many interconnected spaces. Based on the cosmological principle, which states that the distribution of energy and matter, and thus also the curvature of space in the universe, are almost the same everywhere, three prominent shape models arise, which are ultimately defined by the theoretical density parameter. This mathematical entity is drawn from the sum of matter, dark energy, and dark matter. If the universe possesses a positive curvature, we can imagine the galactic total complex as a spherical structure. If the density parameter is exactly one, what results is two parallel straight lines, indicating the reverse conclusion that the universe is flat. The last theoretical model, where the density parameter is smaller than one and the universe has a negative curvature, leads to a saddle-shaped form. Current findings. As we can see, the actual shape of our galactic home in the most modern models of science thus depends exclusively on a single variable the density parameter. For this reason, experts have been eager for several years to determine this mysterious value in order to unravel the mystery of the nature of our cosmic home once and for all. In order to mathematically determine the density in the universe, experts primarily look at the temperature pattern of the cosmic background radiation. Specifically, this is the remnant of the microwave radiation that was emitted into the vastness of the universe during the Big Bang. And indeed, Cosmological investigations currently suggest that the density parameter is about 1, 
As already mentioned, this would mean in the reverse conclusion that the universe has an almost flat form. However, since measurement errors can never be ruled out when investigating space, and the terrestrial view into our galactic environment is limited, this assumption is considered simply probable, but not proven beyond doubt. Besides the three presented models, there exists a further, no less interesting thesis, which draws a completely different picture of our cosmic homeland. The Taurus Model In topology and geometry, a torus describes a bulge-like body which has a big hole in the middle. Earthly objects that take on such a form include, for example, life preservers, tires, and donuts. And indeed, in the field of cosmological research, the idea has been discussed for some decades that the universe might possess the form of that sweet pastry we love so much. The first scientists who proposed this theory were the Soviet physicists Alexei Starobinsky and Jakow Borisovich Seldowich. The experts published their groundbreaking thesis in Moscow in 1984. But what evidence favors the conjecture that the universe is structured like a three-dimensional torus? In order to pursue this question, we must first look at the cosmic background radiation already briefly mentioned. This radiation in the microwave range was first noted by experts in the year 2003. Specifically, these radiation patterns consist of cold and hot spots, which flood the vastness of the universe like invisible waves. The assumption that our universe is infinitely large would therefore also mean that it contains all conceivable waveforms. The researchers were therefore all the more surprised when they discovered that large wavelengths of cosmic background radiation simply could not be detected. In order to explain this circumstance, the scientists put forward the thesis that the universe, contrary to common assumptions, is not infinitely large, but in fact, a finite entity. Put simply, this would mean that the finite universe cannot contain wavelengths larger than itself. The fact that the universe appears to us, in spite of this, like an infinite object, must lie therefore in its form. If the universe has the shape of a sphere, one could travel around on its surface for an infinite time without ever coming across a clearly defined edge. This would also apply to the case in which our galactic home is donut-shaped. The problem with this is that such a shape would inevitably lead to a regular repetition of distant objects in the firmament. Such a hall of mirrors effect has yet to be observed by experts. Nevertheless, the representatives of the donut thesis decided to intensify the investigation of the measured cosmic background radiation in order to find further support for their model. In an effort to investigate the temperature fluctuations in the cosmic background radiation and to make predictions, the experts created several theoretical models of the universe. Among them was an infinite universe and a model in which the universe was constructed as an infinite, three-dimensional torus. And in fact, it was the donut structure that agreed most precisely with the real measured data. With the help of this model, the scientists were even able to determine the exact size of the universe said to extend over an area of about 56 billion light-years. The bottom line is that the experts are still in the realm of theoretical speculation with respect to these hypotheses. Accordingly, more in-depth investigations of cosmic background radiation are needed to find more profound arguments for or against the existence of a torus-shaped universe. Who knew? If the donut model should one day prove true, there is one man who would definitely not be surprised by this discovery, Homer Simpson. The creators of the cult animated series have long been suspected of having clairvoyant abilities. Well, at least tongue in cheek. According to ardent followers, in some episodes of The Simpsons, some events are predicted that are actually expected to happen later. In addition to Donald Trump's presidency, Matt Groening and co. also predicted the attack of a white tiger on Roy Horn. Stephen Hawking made a guest appearance in an episode of the 10th season. After the scientist survives chaos in Springfield, he's invited by Homer for a beer in Moe's Tavern. There, the world-famous scientist tells Homer that he finds his theory about a donut-shaped universe extremely fascinating and is thinking about using the idea for his own research. However, despite all the charming cartoon predictions, the majority of experts consider it unlikely that our galactic home has the shape of a pastry. The lack of regular patterns in the sky that such a shape would have to entail convinces most scientists that the answer to the question of the true shape of the universe is to be found in some other geometric form. 
We hope we could inform and engage you with our contribution today. What are your thoughts on the video? Write us your opinions, feedback, and suggestions in the comments. Now click on one of the images in the credits to see more interesting videos. Thanks a lot for watching, take care, and we'll see you next time.